What's up guys, this is your boy DM with another video for you here. This is uh, another review for the FQ777, FQ17W. And today's review is how well does this uh, mini quad fly with the cell phone itself, only with the cell phone. We're gonna see how, how well it does. You know, because uh, with the controller, obviously, it's a lot easier, more, you know, more practical, etc. So we're going to see how well it does with the cell phone. Today's uh, weather is a beautiful day out. Right now, it's uh, 21. If you can see that, I don't know if you can see that. I hope you can. It says 21. And the winds is showing at about 5 kilometers an hour. Okay. 75% humidity, visibility 9.7 kilometers, blah, blah, blah. So everything's okay. So we're going to put it to the test to see how well it does in, in this type of winds with the controller itself. So we're going to get it hooked up, the controller to the, or actually the cell phone to the drone. Going to the Wi-Fi now, because it has to be connected with Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi is connected. Now we go into its uh, app, which is AirFun UFO. There it is, you see, AirFun UFO. So we hit that opens up press play now we're inside the app as you can see okay we're gonna turn on the there's the controllers right there as you can see so now we're gonna see how well it does or at least how well I can do it but in general it's how well it does with the app so we're gonna start it up and hopefully it's good. All right. Pumped it up to a hundred, so it gives it more power. already crushed it and it came out of the out of the app right away As soon as I press the power on for it and for it to take off, right away it starts going crazy, left, right, very hard to control. Let's do that again. As soon as you press it, boom, it just goes right away. Doesn't even give you a second, nothing. So let's see that again. Okay, it's not going so bad, fairly easy. It's pretty good. 
With the controller, it's not so bad. The only thing I noticed is that it's not good to look at the controller itself because that way, when you do that, it's like, you know, you can't really see it so well how, uh, how it's, you know, always like glitching or freezing, stopping. So it's not giving you like, um, you know, live feed time because you do have to wait, etc. So. But you can see it's going pretty good. I'm handling it not so bad. Okay, maybe spoke too soon. No, don't crash, don't crash. Where am I going with this? Where am I going with this? No, no, no. No! Okay, now it's like I just lost orientation with it. And it just crashed. Orientation was lost with it. So, right away it became a lot more difficult. With the controller, with the, uh, the app itself. So that's a negative because you know how it's touch. It's not as, um, as controlled and as stable as obviously it will be with the controller itself. So let's try that again. Right away, that's the bad thing with the controller. You can have it first, uh, you know, having the props running and then after you lift it up. But with the app itself, I don't see any of that. I just see it like as soon as you press the button, boom, right away it goes up. Don't care where it is. And right away you have to look at the app itself at all times. I'm gonna to try to give you a view like this to show you. I'll move it away because this thing like just goes crazy like a psycho. So on, then it shows you the outlay of the controller, buttons, etc. Here's the takeoff. So as soon as I do that, I'm going to have to look at the drone itself and not through the app because it's a lot more difficult through the app. This I better keep it a little to the right because it tends to go too much to the left, maybe because of the little winds. Like I said, and it just attacked me. Flips is not working for it for some reason. It's not something I would take far distance. The drone itself is very, very good at taking a beating. That I can give it. Very good at taking a beating. That's what I know from it so far. My opinion and review on this is I'm not pleased with it at all. It's, a, it's an interesting concept for this little guy. Very interesting. It does work, 
but it's not something I would, uh, you know, really recommend. I wouldn't really put uh, my focus on it so much as, uh, you know, it's something good just to go out with the controller. I'm um, sorry, with the cell phone or the tablet and the drone itself. I would recommend taking the controller with it because with the controller you'll have uh, more stability, more control, more fun with it, etc. The cell phone itself with the app itself not recommended because as it's touch screen it's even more sensitive and it's not as controlled as it can be with the controller itself because how it's on an app how it's on like the <clears throat> the screen itself that's where you're controlling it so if you're not looking at your controller at all time what you're doing with your fingers you can tend to like go off uh, off balance from uh, you know from one place to another with the fingers from the controller to a button or who knows what and if you got to look at the screen at the same time it'll even be even more harder how it's not uh, really such a good FPV you know and keeping that uh, that connection of the Wi-Fi between the control between the app and the uh, drone itself so all in all I would say you know it's a good thing to try it's it's still fun it's something new exciting but it's not something i would recommend on a daily basis once in a blue moon if you're in an open space you know not winds at all you know you can have fun with it but if you're looking to fly it and enjoy it etc i wouldn't recommend at all through the app itself to control it i would recommend only through the controller that would be your best option and the best choice to go for so anyways this is the fq 777 fq17w with the control with the app itself i hope you guys uh, like this uh, video you hit that like button don't forget to subscribe to the channel to get the the newest uh, updates and uh, reviews and thanks for watching have a drone-tastic day, fly safe, and keep on droning. Peace.